Hey everyone, I'm Justin Fisher. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. It has been 15 years since Bell's Amusement Park closed at the Tulsa State Fairgrounds, and now it's coming back, this time in Broken Arrow. The family announcing the new BA location Thursday morning on East Kenosha Street. That's bordering the Creek Turnpike. The new Bells will be about 10 times the size of the old location at the fairgrounds, and it will have some familiar attractions for you. However, the owner, Robbie Bell, says expect some new things as well. We want people to have see things and do things that remind them of the old location with 2021 technology and, and all that stuff. So yeah, a little bit of both. And the plan is to break the park into four sections. There's going to be the thrill park. That's the roller coasters. There's a kiddie park for the children, a water park, and an indoor entertainment center with things like virtual reality games and go-karts as well. All right, nearly 375,000 kids in Oklahoma ages 5 to 11 can get Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine now that both the FDA and the CDC issued recommendations for it. The Tulsa Health, Tulsa Health Department says while COVID-19 tends to be more mild in kids, they can still have both short and long-term health complications from the virus. There have been more than 14,000 confirmed cases and two deaths reported in Tulsa County among children ages 5 to 17. OU Chief COVID Officer Dr. Dale Bratzler says the pediatric vaccine is 91% effective. All right, let's go look at your weather with Brandon Woolley. Hi, Justin. For today, upper 50s, some peaks of sunshine, south winds between 5 and 10. Overnight tonight, down to 40 degrees in Tulsa. Outlying areas down into the 30s, possibly around 32 degrees. Across far eastern Oklahoma with a freeze warning, but we have 70s coming up for the weekend. Chance for rain by Wednesday. All right, thanks so much, Brandon. That is a look at some of the stories making headlines today. Stick with 2 News Oklahoma for updates all throughout the day.